Hello my beautiful to loves, I hope that you guys are all having a fantastic week. In today's video we are going to be doing part 2 of this area. If you haven't watched part 1 of this area, definitely do. I do show you how I did this area. Today we're just going to continue the video and it took me probably like um, a couple of days to time travel to get so much wheat field items and I still don't have enough. So <laughs> this video just took me forever just because I did have to gather over like 100 plus wheat field items. So originally this video was supposed to be posted yesterday, but there was some areas that I wasn't satisfied with and I just felt like if I put a video out that I wasn't confident with, that I wouldn't be satisfied or happy with it. So I decided to postpone it and fix the areas that I felt unsatisfied with or would it be like unsatisfied yeah <laughs> unsatisfied with so I went back and I fixed some areas that I just didn't like in general and yeah that's why this video is pretty late and another thing I won't be talking a lot throughout this video I've been having a pretty bad headache and I don't want to make it worse I'll just pop in once in a while to tell you guys what I'm doing I also found these super cute vintage dresses and I just love them. I will leave the creator's code down in the description if you guys want to go ahead and use them to wear or to just put out in front of your able sisters. Definitely do check that lovely creator. They are very talented and I just really like how it looks. For this area, I was going to make a little cafe. Well, I am going to make a cafe. I really wanted to use a lot of these storefronts, but when it was like almost finished, I noticed that it looked a little bit odd. So this area is definitely going to change a lot. Like I'm not going to be using a lot of the storefronts. I'm going to use some pergolas in the back. I just felt like it looked a little weird with all of the storefronts. So you'll see major changes to this area. So like I mentioned earlier, this area was going to have some major changes. Instead of using all of the storefronts and making this area look super cluttered, I decided to go with some pergolas and make this area look less cluttered. And I just like how it looks with the pergolas instead of with so many storefronts. So while I was building this area, I noticed that I was adding a lot of these storefront items and I know that I'm trying to give it that illusion of a building but I just, I don't know, I just didn't really feel satisfied with this area and I just felt like I just kept adding a lot of storefronts instead of adding more details to this area. So I tried to put these fairy lights and make this area look better but I just, I don't know, I didn't really like how it looked so instead I'm gonna go ahead and use some custom panels and try to make it look like a little building, a little entrance instead. And now that I'm almost finished with this building, I'm just going to go ahead and start adding some small details. So 
so i talked about this like maybe a few months ago and it was kind of like a 50 50 do you guys like videos with more talking less talking or just music last time it was like a 50 50 and now i want to see what you guys think do you guys like videos with less talking more talking or just music okay so i was casually scrolling on instagram and i seen this really cool photo i'm not gonna go ahead and say their name just because i might butcher it but i will leave the creator's socials down in the description i seen them use the storefronts facing back to back i guess and using i'm not sure if it's called the fence partition i might be wrong but i saw them do that idea and i was like that is so smart so i decided to do this in my island and i thought it was super cool i'll leave the creators down in the social <laughs> I will leave the creator's socials down in the description if you guys want to go ahead and check them out. Also, if you're new to my channel, do not forget to subscribe. I do try to post one to two times a week, only if you want to, of course. And if you are already subscribed to me, thank you so much. I really, really, really appreciate it. I recently hit 700 subscribers and I'm really amazed and happy. And I'm just really, really overwhelmed and happy. Overwhelmed in a really good way, not in a bad way really overwhelmed in a good way and i can't wait to continue this journey with you so thank you so much For my villager houses, I'm going to just keep them pretty simple. I'm just going to add some paths, some trees, and some fencing. So now I'm just going to go ahead and start adding some final details to this area. I am going to go ahead and do some final details or like final touches off camera as well just because I did order some things from the Nooks, from the Nooks Cranny, like the Nooks Shop, the Nooks Shop. And I'm just going to go ahead and add them on. I don't have those items with me right now, but I will see you guys when I'm going to give you guys the final walkthrough of this area. Mm -hmm. 